Good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining me today. I'm Siva Subramanian from Innovent Edutech, a startup company based in Bangalore. I welcome very heartily to you to this webinar. Today, our theme is to learn, apply, and succeed, which reflects our commitment in helping students grasp concepts effectively apply them in real world applications and succeed in their academic and professional journeys. Now, let me take a moment to explore how engineering mathematics can become more approachable, practical, and meaningful for the students. At Mathinova, we are dedicated to supporting students by providing courses that not only simplify concepts, but also connects them to the real world engineering applications. So let's move on to know more how Mathinova engages students in their journey. We are proud to announce our partnership with BTU, Belgavi, Center for Online Education, in offering an e-learning mathematics program for all disciplines across semesters. Now, I'll be failing in my duties if I don't extend my deepest gratitude to the Center of Excellence, Mysuru, and especially the Special Officer, Mrs. Prakuti, who has provided invaluable support throughout this initiative. Mathinova is a flagship program of Finament Edutech, an organization with over 20 years of expertise in delivering academic solutions in simulation to colleges across universities and corporates across our countries. Now, taking advantage of this extensive experience, Edevent embarked on a mission to revolutionize mathematics education. Through in-depth research from a student's perspective, we have developed Mathinova, a meticulously crafted mathematics program tailored to the VTU curriculum. This program is designed by academics and industry experts with hands-on experience in OEM design industries and engineering applications. Now let's get into the first point of why engineering mathematics. Engineering mathematics isn't just numbers. It's the heart of solving real world problems and sparkling innovation. It gives engineers a tool to understand how systems work, improve designs and create new solutions. From predicting how structures behave to optimizing machines, math helps engineers think critically and creatively. By mastering these concepts, engineers can push the boundaries of technology, driving progress and shaping the future in ways we have never imagined. Now, engineering mathematics is fundamental in many core engineering domains. It directly applied areas like machine learning, data science, electrical engineering, and mechanical engineering. For example, in machine learning, we use mathematical models to train algorithms and make predictions. In data science, mathematics helps analyze large data, data sets and extracts valuable insights. Whether we are designing efficient mechanical systems or optimizing electrical circuits, mathematics provides the foundation to solve real world challenges and drive innovation across these fields. Now, one of the key benefits of studying engineering mathematics is that it enhances critical thinking and your analytical skills also. As students work through complex mathematic problems, they are not just memorizing formulas, they are learning how to approach problems logically and analytically. By applying these mathematical concepts to real world engineering scenarios, students develop the ability to evaluate situations from different perspectives, spot patterns, and make data driven decisions. This sharpens the problem solving abilities and equips them with the skills needed to tackle engineering challenges with precision and innovation. Now let's get into the course highlights, a short video for you.
let's have a look at a holistic introduction to a module. Now, each concept is introduced in a clear and elegant manner ensuring students not only understand but also actively engage with the material this approach leads to deeper comprehension and understanding results here's a short snippet from holistic introduction a one minute video for you to glance through if you like to watch a full video this link will be shared in the comment section now let's dive into the video now let's uh, try and uh, understand uh, the half frame series which is also a very, very important uh, component of uh, learning in Fourier series. In uh, many situations, what happens is you may be interested in the general range 0 to L rather than minus L to plus L or 0 to 2L or 0 to 2 pi. You may be just interested in the range 0 to pi. In such situations, what we do is uh, we resort to the half range series. And uh, here, you can either be dealing with the cosine half range series or sine half range series. It would be absolutely specified. You will uh, have to find out only A0 and AN if you are asked to develop half range cosine series. Be uh, mindful of that. And if you are asked to develop a half range sine series, you are just supposed to calculate the B. Now let's uh, try and now let's have a look at how a derivation lecture is explained. Derivations play a crucial role in the journey of engineering mathematics as they empower students to solve a wide range of problems across various branches of engineering. We take special care to simplify these derivations, presenting them in a way that feels as approachable as an elementary subject. Here's a quick snippet for you to explore. We would like to have an integrating factor so that uh, we can solve this particular equation. We would like to have an integrating factor so that uh, we can solve this particular equation. And that integrating factor facilitated to conceive that uh, this is equivalent to the differentiation of uh, rho of x into y, which is obviously the RHS. I differentiate rho of x, I will get the product of rho of x, e of x, and that is what exactly led us to second conclusion. I took all uh, the quantities that I was interested in, rho of x to this side and dx to that side. And when I integrated, uh, I got uh, 1 by rho of x. I deliberately put modulus because I am looking at a positive function. So once I integrate this, I get e of integral of e of x with respect to dx plus a constant of integration. We would like to have. Now let's have a look at how a problem solving lecture looks like. Solving more problems enhances your clarity and deepens your understanding of concepts. To help you achieve this, we have carefully solved and curated a wide range of problems. Each problem has been handpicked to provide multiple perspectives on a single concept, ensuring a well-rounded learning experience. Now let's watch this short snippet. Now here goes uh, the complex potential that uh, we developed, that is uh, the velocity potential and the streamline function, psi. And variable x and y. Remember, if I'm talking about the total differential for uh, this, uh, then it is given by the partial of uh, f with uh, respect to x multiplied by dx plus partial of f of z with respect to y and multiplied by dy. The partial of the velocity potential with respect to x plus i into partial of the stream function with respect to x and of course multiplied by dx plus then that turns out to be phi with respect to y plus uh, psi partial of psi with respect to y of course multiplied by i that should not be forgotten and then multiplied by dy. Now let's look at an engineering application video also. 
when students understand the purpose of learning it ignites their interest and motivates them to engage more deeply our engineering application lectures provide clear justification for how certain engineering concepts are inherently mathematical we have highlighted practical engineering applications for key concepts wherever relevant take a look at our engineering applications snippet video why the stabilization of the axis of a particular satellite becomes very very important because the antenna must be seeing the earth and the coverage of the earth becomes very very critical unless you stabilize the axis of the satellite now here we take up a very very simple situation where we separate the pitch error uh, from the yaw and roll error that is we are isolating the pitch error and uh, trying to develop uh, a differential equation for that how exactly it works you might it have uh, played with the top whenever the top uh, is uh, rotating with a good amount of angular velocity the gravity is trying to pull it down but the gyroscopic uh, stiffness uh, ensures that it remains stable a very similar system a wheel with a large mass moment of inertia uh, with certain angular velocity whenever the satellite tries to uh, deviate from the axis that is whenever it has some angular uh, pitch error then uh, this uh, gyroscopic stiffness actually restores it back now having seen a lot of our short videos and how we have performed in our lecture we would like to show you how to access the courses live on vtu portal now to start with Let's open online vtu dot ac dot in. You have got courses on Blue Ink. Go to all courses, scroll down. You will get the company's profile, all the companies which are offering courses. There you have Math Innova. Click on Math Innova, and you will be getting all the uh, sections, all the four semesters of mathematics available to you, so namely Math One, Math Semester One, Semester Two, Semester Three, and Semester Four. Also, you're gone. Now let's have a lo look at how our programs are placed on the video portal. Click on the uh, engineering mathematics one. Click on curriculum, and you have all the modules which are available on mathematics one semester one. And you can click on to any one of those modules, and you can play them. The preview will play play them as free videos. And if you're interested, you have to just enroll into the portal now we have introduced an engaging section called the fast track learning this is designed to help students refresh their memory focus on key concepts and quickly revise before their exams now let's have a look at this section now this is the uh, fast track learning section of our uh, uh, program here in this we have got all the concepts which has been covered for the first semester for all disciplines like mechanical civil electronics computer science everything all the six concepts are covered and each concept when you get into the we have got important sections like formula and procedures we have got memory maps we have got engineering critical thinking and also engineering relevance now let me just play a, a small video of about 30 40 seconds to show you how we have discovered how we have conceived this program how you got to remember how do you remember step 1 the calculus definition of slope step 2 the coordinate geometry definition of slope step 3 convert the calculus definition of slope in terms of r and theta by introducing an independent variable theta right so there you will have to apply the chain rule then expand the exp coordinate geometry definition of slope tan psi uh, in terms of phi and theta and then compare those two and finally get this particular expression so this is uh, how you remember uh, with the two definition of slopes uh, you would be able to achieve uh, this particular expression so let's move on and look at more discussions so this fast track learning course is going to be very very interesting to the students we have made this course available till the 4th of january free of cost 
to all the uh, students of VTU. They can have a free look at all the modules, which is about 10 to 12 hour course. They can have a quick look at this, but a small word of caution, this fast track learning program is designed to for a quick revision course only. Ideal for brushing up concepts just before the exams, but for a thorough in-depth understanding, it is recommended that you go through the full course so that you'll be able to understand mathematics in a better way. So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for uh, being with me in this webinar. I am. I, I ho hope you have liked this program. Please write to me a mail if you have liked it or if you have got any comments. My number is here given in this. Or you can also contact Mrs. Prakriti, Special Officer Mysore, for more information. Thank you so much.